Place the ball down on the form or nail tip at the free edge. Pat, shape and form the tip at the free edge. Using the tip of the brush, form a smile line from the corner side to the middle of the nail plate. Using the paint powder, apply ball tube to the stress area. Pat and smooth with the center and tip of the brush and blend to the free edge. Apply ball three using the pink powder. Pick up a small to medium sized application and apply it to the center of the nail plate. Pat and smooth with the center and tip of the brush. Now, blend in the product by brushing toward the free edge. Be careful when spreading and patting the product near the cuticle. Too much product in the cuticle area can pull away from the nail plate as it cures, causing the product to lift almost immediately. The amount of product applied in the cuticle area should be the thinnest. Also, any product applied on top of pterygium or excess cuticle tissue will allow moisture and oils from the skin under the product and lifting will occur. Using a medium abrasive, shape the perimeter of the nail first. Begin by shaping the left and then the right side of the nail. Continue on by shaping the free edge and then the cuticle area. Shape the surface of the nail by filing in a side-to-side -side motion from the cuticle area to the free edge. Using a 180 medium abrasive, buff the entire surface of the nail. This will remove any scratches etched into the nail surface while you were shaping. Then buff the nails with a white block 240 360 abrasive. Do not use oil with this abrasive. Buff briefly on top of the nail for an ultra smooth finish. Using a three-way buffer, buff the nail to a super glossy shine. Apply a small amount of cuticle oil to each nail and cuticle. It can't be stressed enough that after the procedure for your client to thoroughly wash her hands. Send your client to the sink with a nail brush and soap. The chemicals used during the procedure can irritate the skin and eyes. It's very important that your client completely wash away any residue or dust that may be resident on the nails, in the nail grooves, or under the nail tips. Your client may decide to have her nails polished now or have them polished sometime later. Whatever the case, remove any traces of oil, lotion, or cream with a nail preparation antiseptic. You'll notice that the nails here look beautiful and natural.